Hello guys, what is up? This is Glad to Go, part of the Pokemon Fan 5, and welcome to Shiny Random Wonder Trades. Today is episode 7, and we got 6 Pokemon to be giving out to you guys. Here's first a Chikorita, a Labrys, a Scrafty, a Jolteon, a Barbaracle, a Corfish. So, all these are shiny, and you get to pick one of them in the comment section. So, all you gotta do is like the video, be subscribed to the Pokemon 5 5 already, and leave a comment saying which Pokemon you want and why, and you, that you want to enter this for one of these Pokemon. And anyway, I'll randomly choose one of you guys. It's, you know, the reason is just to be there, just for me to, you know, read it by and see how things go. These Pokemon are not going to be the exact same Pokemon that you see on the screen right now. And some of them were traded to me. I don't really know. So this is an adamant-natured Scrafty. You know, maybe maybe it may not be adamant-natured. Who knows? But they're all going to be shiny. That's guaranteed. Not going to be the same exact Pokemon, though. So let's get on to trading them. On to randomly wonder trading them as well. And, um, yeah. So on the Pokemon F5 lately, you know, everything... Everything has been really just different. We got free frolls going by. We got shiny one and wonder traits going by. Wonder traits in general going by. Um, just play Pokemon, and you know other members may do some things as well. But I am the shiny one and wonder traits person. So you know what? That's that's my niche with how things go with wonder traits. As we find someone from Espania. What is the person from Espania gonna give me for this nice little Chikorita Moises? I Moise, I don't even know how to pronounce that. But you know what? He's gonna give me a throw. So throw that shit for for Chikorita. That's not even bad. I'm not even mad. I'm rhyming accidentally, but um, you know, that's pretty cool. We don't like. I don't know. I normally don't like get much good stuff off of Wonder Trades, but I don't know. I I enjoy doing them just because I enjoy giving out some good things to people and uh, seeing possibly we can get a return something that may be able to fill up some um, slots. Something unique, you know, throw is cool, and it's in a luxury ball, that's not even bad, and, you know, the moves are okay. Lapras. Lapras is probably, like, my third favorite Pokemon, or my second favorite Pokemon, either one, I don't really know. I just love Lapras so much, it's beautiful, the typing is awesome, it is just, it's like, you know, it's vintage, it's a vintage Pokemon. Whenever you go into the water in the old games, you go on a fucking Lapras. That's just how it is, whether it's a Lapras or not, you're gonna be on a Lapras. Now, in the newer games, you know, you're just, you're, you're riding like an old, thing that looks like a whale mirror if anything it looks weird but um you know nonetheless it's just the vintage pokemon i love it so much and it's pretty and it's awesome and it's like defensive and it, it can be a, used for attack as well it's just it's awesome we got a nice little fur for that i don't, I don't even mind fur 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 is cool you get it often but you know what you don't really get to appreciate it enough i'm doing i'm using it in my wonder lock i'm liking it so far i you know i temporarily stopped using it but i may start using it again I'm doing a Wonderlock on my channel, and, um, you know, it's all fun. I know you guys are enjoying the Wonderlock going on in this channel. Let's just play Pokemon. So, if you want to see more Wonderlock, you can go ahead on my channel. If you want to see any of the other content that's on the Pokemon Fab 5, you can go ahead and check that out after this video. A quirky nature when I even done. Nah, that's, that's meh. That's a meh for Furfro over there, but you know what? It's Furfro's cool. I'm not even going to mind about that. But here's Greaves the Scrafty, and the one that actually spawned me. Um, you know, he uses the same exact Scrafty, and he loves it. And he's used it in the uh, Free For All before, and he was trying to wreck shit up with this. And I'm like, yo, chill. Why is the name Greaves anyways? I don't even know. Maybe it kind of looks like it. Shiny Scrafty looks weird as hell. And I don't. That's, that's the reason why I don't think many of you guys would want it, because it looks really weird shiny. But nonetheless, Scrafty is a beast, so... And the, and the typing, f fighting dark. I mean, you can't really get any, you can't really get any worse than that. It's all, it's pretty awesome. <laughs> we got a scraggy for a scrafty. Okay, I see that. That's awesome. That's pretty funny. Just trading off evolutions, except this one ain't shiny. So we're trading a shiny scrafty for a scraggy that's named Pants. I mean, I know that his pants are loose and he has to hold them up and shit. But why the hell would you name it Pants? I don't know, man. I, that's the type of nickname I give a Pokemon, because of how lame I am with my nicknames. Is this at least an adamant? Scraggy? I mean, come on, man. You gotta give me a decent one. Naughty. Alright. Alright, whatever. And uh, this one is this random Jolteon. I don't even know. I just found it in my box. I probably got it from a tray. Maybe something like that. I don't know. I make your shiny. Maybe I was doing, uh, you know, maybe I was trading, doing a giveaway or something like that, and... Um, they gave me a shiny back. His name is My Maker Shiny. I don't even know. It's not gonna. I, I promise you, the Jolteon. If you win, if someone wins there and they win Jolteon, your Jolteon will not be named I Maker Shiny. So don't worry about that. 
Again, not going to be the same exact Pokemon. If they're nicknamed, I may unnickname them. If they're the you know, same exact Pokemon, then um, probably will just uh, keep the nickname, if anything. And, uh, I don't know, it looks pretty cool and all, but it's kind of stupid at the same time. It's fucking, it's a candle. It's a fucking candle. I mean, I don't mind it, but at the same time I do mind it. It's kind of stupid, kind of useless. But Chandelure is, like, I guess, a strong Pokemon, but I don't like it either. It's an amnet. <laughs> it's an amnet object. I mean, come on. But, uh, you know, that's just me. I'm not a huge fan of an amnet object Pokemon. But this, they tend to be really strong for whatever reason. A modest one, that's pretty good. The Japanese people know how to, you know, deal with their whole entire, um, I guess, breeding situations. Because usually whenever I get, like, usually whenever I get, like, um, Pokemon through Wonder Trade from, like, different countries, like, that are in Japan, they're, they're just bred terribly. Like, I gotta get, like, a Hone Edge that's modest. I'm like, okay, what are you trying to do here? Are you trying to fuck someone over on Wonder Trade or something like that? I don't even know. I mean, if you want to really get yourself a good, good, good Hone Edge, because it, its name was 118, so I'm guessing he, that was his 118th Hone Edge that he hatched. Like, if you're trying to get a shiny Hone Edge, at least give it the right, like, nature. I don't know. If you're going to be breeding for that long, I'd really appreciate it if you're actually pretty good. But, you know what? It's okay. I'm not going to be bitching about how people breed their Pokemon. It's how they want to do it. And Pikachu, well, he's pretty good. It's another Japanese Pikachu. Ooh, two Japanese people in a row. Well, two Japanese Pokemon, at least, in a row. It's so adorable. I just want to pinch its giant cheeks. The cheeks of freaking fury. You know, if you pinch them, you're going to get electrocuted and die. But I ain't even mad because it's so damn cute. A quirky one. Okay, this is not even red, red well, I guess. But here is a level 50. I, I don't even know. I don't even know how I got this. I don't know where I got it from. It has some pretty good moves. But, um, you know, maybe level 1, maybe level 50, who the hell knows? Maybe, maybe it may be the correct level, since this thing could just be evolved within a level away of being a Crowdont. Crowdont's cool, though. I like Crowdont a lot, but, um, the, the Pokemon I think a lot of people will, will um, ask for will be Barbarical. I just have a feeling a lot of you guys would want that. If this is a Gen 6 Pokemon, it's not that seen, it's not seen often at all. And, um, well, it's, I guess it's kind of rare in a way, but... Anywho, thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Shiny Random Water Trailers. We got two Pikachus in a damn row. Um, you know, I'm not even mad again. It's so cute and shit, and I want to pinch the cheeks unless I'm going to get electrocuted. But yeah, check out the other videos of the Pokemon Fat 5. Make sure to check out my channel. Make sure to leave a like, comment below of what Pokemon you want and why, and be subscribed already. And that's all I'm asking for. So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching, and have a nice day. Peace.